how how did the move out to wing work for you? I mean, you get the goal. Uh, did you feel comfortable out there last night, Max? Yeah, I, you know, I, I've played all three positions at the the forward um, part. So um, left wing, right wing, center doesn't really matter. Um, I I like them all. <laughs> Obviously, like having the puck. So um, you know, last night I, I know it was a, it was a weird game. It was a tough game. Um, some downs just here and there, obviously, but uh, I think um, we, we played a little bit better offensively. Obviously, when you score that many goals, you usually want to try and win those games, but um, something to build on for sure. So uh, we got in there, crack at them tonight, and uh, we'll try and kind of pick up on the, on the good stuff we did last night and fix the, the stuff that needs work. Max, to hammer one home the way you did yesterday, what does that, what does that do for your confidence? Those are fun goals to score, I would imagine. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Um, to be honest, I've, I've never been, really been much of a one-timer threat before, so um, I guess, I don't know, kind of weird, a little lucky, but uh, it's a heck of a play by by Scotty Harrington, uh, a good buddy of mine that goes back to junior. And, I mean, you, you see him, the kind of pro he is every single day, shows up to the rink, never complains, hardest working guy on the ice, stays out late after practice. He's always in the gym. Um, and you see the performance, I mean, that he put on last night comes in and it's like he didn't miss a beat. So I'm um, super happy for, for Harry. And that was a great play on the goal. That's that's all him for sure. Max, the uh, Carolina four checks pretty aggressive. They were last night, seemed to befuddle you a couple of times. Uh, how, do you, how do you have more success against that aggressive group tonight? Yeah, it's a great hockey team. Obviously, they've, they've shown what they can do in the past few years and um, well coached and their systems are very aggressive and, and you know that whether it's on the on the power play when they're gonna when they're gonna send their pk at you um they don't give you much time and space and it's no different five on five so um i mean you know it's 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 fun because if you if you make them miss sometimes then that's when you get some opportunities some some odd man breaks but uh they got some some pretty legit defensemen back there and obviously a great group of forwards and then some good goalies too so uh we're gonna have to be ready to go tonight it's a good team um but we're we're a good team too and we know we can beat them and we gotta find a way here is, is there anything about the nature of last night's game, the, the weird goal on what we all know now was an offsides and the one that bounced in late that you guys have to move past? you have to move past some of the oddities of yesterday's game? Yeah, 100%. I think we already moved past it. I mean, right after it was, I mean, the, the next puck drop. So uh, it is what it is. That's part of the game. And um, you got to use that and grow as a hockey club. And uh, so it's all about. So um, like I said earlier, it's, it's the best part about this whole season is, is you get another crack at the same team the next day or two and, and today it's the next day so uh, we're looking forward to it thanks max okay next we'll go to clay hall go ahead clay hey max I, I understand you have to move past it were you shaking your head yesterday the way the league i mean handle the challenge the, the penalty goes away are part of it but the goal stands i mean what was the buzz around the room because you should be playing overtime right now tied at five yeah, like I said, that's just an irrelevant way of thinking, and uh, it's not how we're going to think around here. It is what it is. We've moved past it, and we're getting ready for tonight. Um, I don't know if you saw the Seth Jones commercial. He said some guys were kind of chirping at him, texting him. Uh, he appeared four or five seconds in an ad. Did you see it by chance? Um, I didn't see it, no. Um, but Jones, he's a stud. I'm sure he looked great. <laughs> But he will get some brass for this, right? Uh, I don't know. I think it's pretty cool. Yeah. <laughs> you got to give, give respect where it's due. And, I mean, like I said, guy's a stud, great dude, heck of a hockey player. So um, being in commercials comes with that, I guess. And <laughs> I haven't seen it, but I look forward to seeing it.